For day-to-day -day clinical work, we often will just use a 40X non-oil objective. This gives us a lot of versatility. If we have an optical zoom system, we can simply zoom in on what it is that we're looking at. We can take our turret condenser, rotate it, and get a nice dark field view. If we want a three-dimensional perspective, we could just shift our condenser slightly and we get that nice three-dimensional perspective. And we can flip it back to phase contrast. So we have a number of different views that we have available to us with a 40x non-oil objective. But sometimes we might want a little more magnification and we might want some more resolution. In that case, we would go to an oil objective. Now for an oil objective, we're going to move our 40x out of place and we're actually going to put some immersion oil, one drop, right on the cover slip. Then we move our objective into place. Now this is a 100x oil objective, phase contrast objective. You saw I moved it into the oil and then I just slightly back and forth to set the objective in the oil. If I have oil up here, the condenser is, it has a um, 1.25 numerical aperture on the condenser, so the condenser must also be oiled. So there I'm putting a drop of oil on the bottom condenser and we're going to move the condenser up in place. Now since we have a 100x objective here, which is a pH 3, there's actually a little pH 3 written onto the objective itself, I'll need to move my condenser to pH 3, so those two things match. Now I move up my condenser. The oil actually from the bottom is going to hit the slide, and I will need to focus. Now I certainly don't need to be zoomed in anymore, so I'll zoom out all the way. And now we've got our oil perspective, more magnification, and higher resolution.